Sons, Pity, the Great Mother, and Bodhi, the Great Father, created the Earth. Then came the Black Whippy, Mother Bat, and Black Whippo, Father Bat, who made thousands of eggs, out of which the first of human tribes, the Kabi, was born. Kabi ancestors lived in the Longley Achete, middle of the Earth. They migrated through the White Earth and Rocky Mountains. They crossed the mighty seas, as wide as the eyes can see, and as far as the ears can hear. In the earliest wave, they finally reached the green and fertile lands of present-day Northeast India. After the discovery of this green land, the ancestors built a village of thousand households strong on the banks of Tonsuri, a peaceful community, the Karbi lived in these green lands, which they called home. Through free community farming called the Jirkeda, the young and adults built a prosperous community full of love and harmony. Then came the invaders and headhunters who looted, slave raided and disrupted the settlements of the Karbi. The new land demarcations of the conquerors forced the Kabi ancestors to disperse in all directions of present-day Northeast India. The ancestors could barely hold on to their own in their territories of Longkhan, Chintong, Anri, and Boinindri in the upland, and the Dumbra region in the Ahom frontier. Then came the colonizers, the British Raj occupying territories, shaping their polity and exploiting the land and its people. An epic journey of hope, fear and angst, commitment and perseverance hence began, leading to the creation of an autonomous district on 17th November 1951. History was thus created. Identity is hence recognized and unity is celebrated. The formation and recognition of Kalbi Anlong Autonomous Council stands testimony to the history of an epic journey. And we commemorate this historic day. We celebrate the moments that led to what is today. <laughs>